and we're in the Victorian high country, which has got some of the best riding in Australia. The emphasis with this bike is adventure touring is the message we're getting. That off-road technology has gone into this parallel twin motor. My name is Rosie Lalonde, I'm the marketing manager for Husqvarna Motorcycles Australia and we are here on the all new Husqvarna Motorcycles Norden 901 media launch. We have brought seven journos out here to test in real world conditions. We've got a great mixture of bitumen roads, gravel roads and this amazing high country experience for them to put the Norden through its paces. I'm really excited to see what the journos think and what they can tell the Aussie customers about this bike in Aussie conditions. You know, every day on a bike is a good day, right? But some days honestly are better than others. It's pretty hard to beat riding around in the Victorian high country. The trails have been amazing. And the bike, the Husqvarna Norden 901, which we've waited for for so long, and it's finally here. And it looks so much more impressive in person than it does even in photos. Early impressions of this bike were good. It's super comfortable. It's marketed as an adventure tourer. So it's not for guys looking to do some hardcore riding, but the guys that want to take those dirt roads that wind millions of kilometers all the way around this country, this is turning out to be one of the bikes that they should be looking for. It's doing the business for us today up here in the high country. The emphasis with this bike is adventure touring is the message we're getting. And that's what's coming through loud and clear today on the first day of the media launch ride. Price competitively, the fit, the finish, the detail, manufacture, really impressive. And the other consensus amongst all the journos has been, it looks so much better in the flesh than it does in imagery, both print and digital. Just gonna be a bike that really is appropriate for Aussie adventure tours. That's the big summary that I've got for it. Well, after two days of riding, I have to say I am seriously impressed by the Norden 901. It is comfortable, capable, and it adds another layer to the competitive middleweight adventure bike segment. We're here with the Husky Norden 901. And I have to say, it seems a pretty exceptional motorcycle at this early stage of our ride. We're in the Victorian high country. This bike has done some amazing road miles today, some amazing dirt road miles. The bike sings, it flies. It's a really nice bit of gear. The bike shines in a really wide range of conditions. Um, and for probably 98% of riders out there that are gonna be doing, you know, probably majority tarmac, some gravel roads, maybe really occasionally a bit of snotty stuff. This is going to do everything that, that those riders are going to need. And for Husqvarna fans who they haven't had this bike in the lineup for a long time, they've been frothing and waiting for a bike like this to come onto the market. It's going to meet all your demands pretty comfortably. For, for other riders who are not necessarily a Husqvarna fan at this point in time, this is definitely something that you actually need to go and have a serious look at. Pretty exciting time for, for Husqvarna. Uh, really exciting time for us to be able to finally get on you know, board these things and, uh, and be part of that history with Husqvarna you know, getting into this segment for the first time. So super high quality. You know, it's beautiful and I think, you know, the other thing is the first thing you get when we got on this thing today was just like, man, how refined that beautiful parallel 889cc twin is. It just purrs and it just eats up, it eats up K's like it's going out of fashion. So predominantly today we spent a lot of stuff on road, uh, tested originally with the lower seat, but super planned on the road and just really locked in and you can have a ball going through a twisty. It's a bike that does everything really well. Um, it's, it's great off-road so far. We, we haven't been on the, the most extreme of tracks, but um, it's definitely capable on your rougher type fire trails. Exceptionally smooth bike on the road. It handles beautifully. Um, no hidden surprises, incredible brakes. Um, but overall, stock standard, it's, it's a beautiful bike.